Tilapia fish tacos with arugula. Crispy wonton cups filled with pan-fried fish, diced mangoes and avocados, and topped with wasabi creme fraiche. I'm brushing some wonton wrappers for my tilapia fish tacos with arugula. I brush them with vegetable oil on both sides. Then I just gently with my fingers press them into these muffin cups. When they bake, they're light and crispy and you can fill them with vegetables and the fruit and the fish. Alrighty, we're gonna pop these in the oven 375 for five minutes. I have some tilapia fillets that I had my fish monitor cut in about three quarter inch cubes. And it's a nice white fish. It's got a nice mild flavor, slightly sweet. I really like it with this because it's not overpowering at all. And we just kind of massage the fish pieces with the salt and the pepper. Add some olive oil to my nonstick skillet. That way the fish doesn't stick and fall apart. Because once it's cooked, it's nice and flaky. And then just put it in the pan. There we go. And the dressing is very easy. Lime juice, olive oil, and salt. So now you just wanna whisk it. See how our fish is doing? Doing really good. So now, some mango. So sweet and good. Wow, these are good. Next, avocado. I really like this because you get sweetness and juiciness from the mango and then that kind of buttery flavor and texture from the avocado. A couple more ingredients. Get the scallions in there. And we're also gonna add some arugula. I like to just take the arugula and just rip it up with my fingers. You could chop it if you want to, but it's easy enough just to tear it. We have time to make a little wasabi cream. We're gonna start with some creme fraiche. Half a cup of creme fraiche. This is really, really easy. It'll be the topping of the fish and you get that creaminess. You need a little something that's creamy in here. It's very similar to sour cream, but not as sour as sour cream. It doesn't have that bite. And then, the wasabi part. Powdered wasabi, or wasabi powder. And I just need one tablespoon. Now, wasabi powder isn't quite spicy in the sense of like um, hot pepper spicy. It's more spicy like a hot mustard. You know where you kind of feel it in your nostrils but not really in your mouth? That kind of spicy. There we go. This is a good thing to have, even to put in mashed potatoes. I really like it in there too. Mix that together. It's nice and creamy. I'm assembling my last few fish tacos. And look at these wontons. Look how easy it is to get them out. And see, they're lightly golden right on the top. So you want to keep them this way. Otherwise, they burn very quickly. And I just scoop some of the salad in. Mangoes, avocado, arugula, and then the tilapia that we pan sauteed. We can fit about, I don't know, three pieces. This is why you want to cut them kind of small. And then top it with a little bit of the wasabi cream right on top. A little creme fraiche, a little wasabi powder in this. And ta-da!